Hey folks, Bobby Casey here. Thanks for joining me on today's edition of Business Anywhere. So if you don't mind, please go ahead and like and share this video. Let's help get the word out and I would appreciate it. Today we're going to be talking about using LLCs for asset protection. Okay, so a lot of times when we're talking about asset protection, essentially what we're talking about is protecting your assets from any future potential creditors. So, you know, the example I like to use a lot of times is you have a Super Bowl party at your house and uh, your, your buddy drinks too much beer at your house, drives home, gets in a car accident and hurts somebody, and then they or their family sue you for over serving. So in that case, you could easily get sued. And, you know, obviously there's a myriad of examples, but in that case, you could get sued for over-serving and contributing to his inebriation, which would cause the accident. So in that case, they would sue you. And then the attorney is going to look at uh, assets you have. Maybe you've got some cash in a bank or uh, some real estate assets or some stock portfolios or businesses or cash flow or that kind of, kind of thing. So a lot of times... Um, the, the best thing you can do and the simplest, most like step one of asset protection is to get all of your significant assets out of your name. Now, I don't when I say significant assets, I don't mean your 2008 Toyota Camry. I'm talking about significant cash assets or like bank accounts, large you know cash bank accounts, uh, brokerage accounts with uh, a lot of money in them real estate holdings, and we'll get into detail in other videos because I'm trying to keep these short and sweet. But what I'm talking about is getting these significant assets out of your own name because those are the easiest targets. That's the low hanging fruit for uh, that claimant's attorney to come after your assets. And so the, the step one, the base, the ground floor, basic level of asset protection is to get these assets out of your name. And LLCs, U.S. domestic LLCs, are oftentimes one of the simplest, easiest, and also most overlooked tools of getting these assets out of your own name. So let's say, just a couple of examples, let's say you got a few rental properties. Maybe create a Wyoming LLC to hold one or more of these properties. And we'll get into structuring uh, real estate holdings and LLCs in a later video, but create one or more LLC to hold these properties. And then when that claimant's attorney's coming after you, they can't see you know, they can't see in public record that you own anything. So that's step one. Step two is they're not owned by you. They're owned by another separate legal entity, the LLC, that is a layer of protection or a shield for coming after your personal assets. The nice thing is, is if you have all of your assets, significant cash assets, brokerage accounts, businesses, real estate, all these things, if you have them in uh, LLCs, and I use Wyoming LLCs often because of their statutes with protecting assets, especially for single member LLCs. But if you use these tools, you can actually in public record look like you have no assets. And sometimes just that layer, that step all by itself uh, is enough of a, a, a hurdle for that claimant's attorney to jump through to say, well, you know what, this this uh, this person doesn't look like a good target for us, so let's move on. Or maybe he goes back to his client, and, you know, the claimant uh, attorney client goes back to his client and says, well, looks like we're going to have a lot of work ahead of us here, so uh, I'm going to need a $20,000 retainer to move forward. So anyway, using LLCs to own these assets uh, are a huge, huge hindrance, and also the protection itself for any claimant that does know that you own assets in an LLC, claimants coming after these assets in an LLC is very, very difficult. So I would highly encourage you to do a bit of research. You can you can reach out on our site. We've got a lot of blog uh, content about this. Plus, we can help you with forming your LLC. So until next time, thanks and take care. Have a great day.